We are now wrapping up our conversation with Wilmington Chief of Police, uh, Bobby Cummings. Thank you so much for being here. Let me just say personally that I know a lot of people who would have canceled this interview because of the Newsweek uh, article and because of the numbers and I, I admire you so much for not doing that and for coming in here because I think it's important that you talk to the public all the time. This show represents your citizens and you're talking to them so I, yes. I, I admire that a lot. Um, what can we expect from you in this coming year? How will things be different? Well what you can expect from the police department is that um, we are more open to partnering um, with the residents. We're open to partnering with our organizations that are in a non-traditional sense um, to improving what's happening in our city. We have a police academy class that will be coming out um, shortly and we're going to be back at authorized strength. So the presence that we can provide on the street is going to be much greater and the service in which we again provide, you're going to see a deeper commitment from the officers to make sure that we build trust within our community. And I know you've been working closely with the federal government, with the state, and with the county. We had yes. Elmer Setting in here uh, a little while ago, and he said that you didn't have the computer resources that you need, and he's, he's trying to help out with that. With, with everything coming together uh, to, to focus on Wilmington and help with Wilmington, do you think people on the streets are going to notice this immediately? They're not going to notice it immediately, but they will see an impact um, coming. Again, all, all I can say is there are going to be a lot of tremendous things that uh, will be coming out of this partnership uh, with the um, Department of Justice and our neighborhood um, associations that people will see it within. So they'll, uh, see, they'll, they'll, they'll see officers more. They're going yes. to see uh, uh, some of the brass more out in their neighborhoods, yes. and you're going to have community meetings. Uh, one last question, and this is ab about you, because you're at the center of this whole thing. H how are you holding up under it all? I'm doing fine. Um, a lot of people ask me that a lot. Um, are you under stress or how do you feel? And what I say is that it's not personal. This is a business that we have to do. Um, this is what I do and I'm good at it. Um, but at the end of the day, I don't take it home and, and stress over it. Um, so how I get through it is again to treat it as a business and build relationships and invite anyone in who's willing to help us. Do you think about uh, how much you will be heralded if you're able to fix this problem? I mean, you're going to be, you could, you very well could be, it's getting national attention, you could be a national star if you fix this. I don't, those things are never on the fore, uh, front of my mind. The thing is, um, I just want to help people. I want to help this city. I want to move us forward. Um, so I, I never look at it in those terms. Oh, we do, though. And we, we, we'll do it for you. <laughs> Thank, Thank you. you so much. I really appreciate you coming appreciate in today. Uh, more than you know. Wilmington Chief of Police, Bobby Cummings, who has a difficult job, and we're all pulling for him in the new year. I hope you had a happy new year. We'll see you again next week.